Hi everyone, my name is Maria and welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we're going to talk about uh, what are the other uh, duties and roles that we are uh, doing during our day-to-day -day, um, work as a document controller. the site um, as a document controller one of your duties are sending emails to the engineers to your project managers to the client to the contractor and so on so usually we are using the Microsoft Outlook so how to um, use this and what are the things that make you easier um, to see uh, who are the one uh, sending you emails and uh, uh, make your life easier right because we are very busy busy on each day and your inbox will be full of emails from the engineer from your team from the client from the contractor it will be full and it's very hard to track if you only keeping up one inbox so uh, each day every day uh, you are receiving phone calls you are receiving emails uh, some emails are high importance some emails are need to reply some emails are urgent um, some are um, like you need to give some copies uh, you need to send links and all so if you have for example in your team if you have like 15 in a team engineers or if you have if you are dealing with also with client and all contractor and all in your inbox it will be mixed right it will be mixed so how you will make it uh, easier um to easily uh, see uh, the emails from your team from contractor and so on so from here i think here or here <laughs> you will see um like inbox on your outlook and then for example uh, you have um like uh, for example 10 engineers in a team or 15 engineers or whoever uh person who send you mostly the emails and sometimes it's hard to track uh, checking in the inbox where is his emails when he sent these emails if you if you did you reply on these emails and so on so what you're gonna do in your inbox okay um you have to create uh folders okay subfolders on the inbox like for example i am maria so you will put in the inbox for example maria for example um you have another engineer's name muhammad so you will put muhammad okay then after that uh how you will do uh to make the emails for example from me to put in one inbox okay so for example i send you email you will see in your inbox that in my name there is one email that i read okay so you will be like aware of it okay that oops i sent i, I received an emails from this because uh, thousands of emails or hundreds of emails um you will receive every day okay so really sometimes if you are really busy busy in submittals busy in love busy in the phone calls for inquiries and all and then uh you have emails to uh, monitor right so at least if you put in your outlook a uh, name of the engineers or name of the person who are always sending you emails uh it's easy for you uh to track it and to see it and uh to reply on him especially if that is an urgent um emails okay that need your response okay so from there so you put the name muhammad okay and then at the above um oh okay maybe here or here <laughs> at the above uh, you will click rules okay so rules when you click the rules um you will see a uh, manage rules okay from the manage rules it will pop up like um where you gonna put that one inbox okay so you will click on uh, when you click that specified folder the specified folder or names then it will uh, when you click it it will go to the emails 
okay so you will search from there uh, or you can type also uh, from uh, whom you want to uh, see that email for example from Maria on my email so you will type you if it's uh, in the contact list so you will see it but if not you can type and then after that if you type you will see there a specified folder um, uh, which folder you want to put there so uh, before you click the rules right you write my name for example Maria and then so so in the specified folder you will also click Maria and then next 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 and then uh, run and apply so that's it that's so easy that's so easy to um, easily track uh, because you know uh, in the construction in the in this kind of field it is always um, urgent it always like uh, as a DC uh, you should always reply on time so another thing another thing uh, for example you're so busy and then you're sending emails right so sending emails blah 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 dear blah 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 dear sir please find attach blah blah blah, blah. you attach something and then by mistake you send it to the wrong persons instead for example Maria you send it to Marie like like something like that sometimes it happens that you are sending emails uh, for example to the wrong person and then for example especially if that is very confidential emails or really uh, a very important document so what you gonna do so for example uh, it's already sent it so and then you need to recall it you need to recall the 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 email so that he cannot open uh, whatever emails uh, you've received right so from there from your sent items okay you will click actions and from that actions um, you will there is like options if you want to delete the unread message or if you want to delete and replace the the correct one the wrong the correct attachments okay so you just click it and then recall okay sometimes uh, uh, this outlook will send you that your uh, recall is successful okay if you did not receive message sometimes if the emails are are open to the person uh, that you're sending with so it will not uh, successfully recall okay so that's that's also very important guys uh, that you know how to recall messages because sometimes really we're not perfect we're not perfect um sometimes um due to the heavy loads or and, um busy days sometimes you really um uh, uh, get mistakes of sending emails so that one i hope things will uh help you a lot for this thing huh? because that is very 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 important if you made mistake at least uh in uh, at least after a second or after uh uh, three seconds or one minute you send the, the message you can recall it and you can send another a new one okay the correct one that's all guys i hope i give you one informative uh, videos about uh what are our other roles as a document controller and how to use the microsoft outlook okay i know that everybody knows how to send emails how to attach but at least uh you know how to make your life easier as always we need to make our life easier and i hope this things this video uh, will help you a lot or at least you have the idea uh, of how to how to use this my microsoft outlook okay if this is your first time to visit my channel don't forget to subscribe and like my videos and i hope um that i could uh, reach you out and um uh, answer some of your queries about the work of a document control controller so if you had any questions or uh, suggestions don't forget to put comments below thank you guys bye bye god bless